This video covers how to perform a MEGAR test. This tests the insulation resistance between the conductive core and the grounding braid, detecting damage that can result in the cable shorting out to ground. This test is very important because failure could trip a circuit breaker or cause a fire. When installing or testing any Chromalox heat trace product, always utilize the proper personal protective equipment and be sure to comply with all applicable safety guidelines. Before beginning the MEGAR test, ensure that all test equipment is working properly and calibrated. Only qualified and trained personnel should administer the test. During system startup, MEGAR tests should be completed before tracing pipes, after installing terminations, before insulating pipes, after insulating pipes, and before energizing the system. In order to perform a MEGAR test, you will need an insulation resistance tester also known as a MEGAR. The MEGAR should be a minimum of a 1000 volts DC, but using a 2500 volts DC MEGAR is best. If possible, use a battery operated MEGAR. However, a digital or analog MEGAR will work as well. Now let's get started. The first step is to open the cover on the power termination kit and disconnect the wires from the terminals. Next, connect one lead to the ground braid and one lead to the bus wires. Perform the insulation resistance test for one minute. After one minute, check the reading. You are looking for a minimum of 20 meg ohms at receipt of material, 5 meg ohms after installed on the pipe, and 5 meg ohms during routine maintenance at 1000 volts DC. Then record the tested value in the log. The mega test is now complete. For more information on any other Chromalox product, visit www.chromalox.com.